Welcome to Raw Sports TV 23. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you subscribe. Now, as the reign of the Golden State Warriors over with, the Golden State Warriors are currently 12 and 14 in the Western Conference, sitting at the 11th seed in the Western Conference. The Golden State Warriors have dominated the NBA, winning four championships with their star studded lineup Clay Thompson, Steph Curry, Draymond Green as their core. But this season, there are several issues that is wrong with the team. Fatigue, age, injury, and some of the outlandish craziness of Draymond Green has interfered in the chemistry of the Golden State Warriors the last past two seasons. But another thing that has really, really hindered the Warriors play has been Klay Thompson. Klay Thompson has struggled this season, averaging 16.5 points a game. He's also not really been good from three-point territory. Now, Klay Thompson's career average is 19.7 points a game. He is currently averaging 16.3 points a game. The Warriors are ranked 20th in defense of rating and 20th in offensive rating. Now, with these type of numbers, the Golden State Warriors won't be able to make the playoffs or win a championship. Now, Stephen A. Smith gives his opinion on Klay Thompson and the Golden State Warriors. Now, Klay Thompson did help lead the Golden State Warriors in 2022 to an NBA championship. Now, he did struggle that year due to dealing with two severe lower leg injuries that most basketball players would not be able to recover from or be the same. Now, with that being said, since the media has called out Klay Thompson, uh, Kendrick Perkins, Stephen A. Smith, he has turned around his game. He had a 28-point game, 24-point game, and a 30-point game. He also is currently having a 24-point game against the Boston Celtics, and he's on fire. He may not be quite the same Klay Thompson defensively that he was. Now, he did, like I said, turn down a two-year, $48 million contract. If I'm the Golden State Warriors, I am not going to get rid of Klay Thompson. He's a very streaky shooter, but he's showing signs of improvement. You don't want to get rid of him, send him to another team, and then he just absolutely haunts you, shooting lights out and making it a problem for you as the Golden State Warriors. I say keep Klay Thompson. I see him turning things around. I see the confidence coming back. The improvement is happening. Do not trade him, but don't sign him to a max. They got to definitely work something out with Klay Thompson. He is key and vital to their success. Peace. Let me know what you think. Comment below.